Hi, and welcome to the Musician's Notepad uh, 2017 year wrap-up. Uh, I'm going to be doing this one kind of on the fly, so there'll be a lot of ums edited out and a lot of restarts and kind of quick cuts. But, eh, that's the way it is. So over this year, we put out 12 grooves of the month and uh, 11 plus one publications, if you count that last multi-pack publication as being the, you know, the final one. It's the one thing we were really able to hold to this year, we're really happy about. Um, I myself uh, ran into some extra work in the beginning of the year and had to cut myself down to putting out, you know, one every, uh, you know, just when I could. And that's a big change that happened this year, is that instead of putting something out, whether it be an article or a video, is I basically put things out when I could. Um, and so for the first half of the year, it was just groups of the month and publications, and I was able to hold to that, and I'm really happy. Sometimes Sometimes they came late, but they're all there. I was only able to put out one teaching tips. I got a lot of those in a backlog right now. We were out, be able to put out two percussion and pop culture. Very happy about putting those out. Uh, our first episode of So You Want to Be a Drummer took a very long time to put together, but very happy that it happened. We interviewed Drew Weber, the uh, co-founder of Musician's Notepad. It was really great to be able to have him on and do that. Really enjoy that. And of course, we put out our basic recap. So what do we have coming forward? Well, I'm hoping that we're are going to do more So You Want to Be a Drummer. Uh, I hope that we are going to be able to revive I'm Not A. We did before, we did I'm Not a Metal Drummer, which I'm not, and I got to interview a great local metal drummer. Uh, I want to be able to bring lots of other things that I'm not. You know, I'm not a great classical percussionist. I don't play a lot of musicals. I would love to have uh, some of those people on. I'm in talks to get some interviews going on that, so hopefully we'll be able to bring you more of those. Uh, of course, more teaching tips. I said that I've got a big backlog of those, so I'm hoping to bring those to you as well. More or teaching and technology. Uh, we didn't put out any of those this year, uh, except for one. I'm hoping to get the one for the body strap out. Um, this is the Soundbrenner Pulse body strap. I do like it. Um, I've got a review that's nearly done. It's been shot. So what happened on that? I know I've been promising it if you've been following the Instagram. Uh, which is my personal Instagram. If you've been following that, you see that I've been working on it. Uh, I had a family emergency. I had to leave town, so I lost kind of a week, week and a half of, of work there. Uh, so I'm trying to get this out. I'm probably not going to put it on a Wednesday. I'll just kind of float it when I can get it out and, uh, yeah, get that out to you guys. I'd like to put out more skill-oriented type videos like mallet wrapping. I promised the guys at PASIC two years ago, the, 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 the friends that I made there while I was working doing the volunteering, I promised them I would do a mallet wrap video soon, and it's been more than a year. So uh, I hope that gets out soon. Um, and uh, I'd love to do more on-location things, just, you know, the basic recaps. I'd love to go to more shows, things like that. So here's a big thing with any of that, is that I would love your help. I would, you know, love for a musician's notepad to be bigger. Uh, that was always sort of the goal with me and Drew, was that this wouldn't just be the two of us talking about teaching private percussion lessons, but the community of uh, percussion educators talking about teaching private lessons. So if you think you've got a video idea, Float it to me. Let's work on getting it made. Um, you know, it's very possible if you don't think you've got the editing, well, maybe you can shoot it. If you can shoot it well, you can send it to me, you know? Um, and I can edit it. You know, I'm working on uh, actually style guides for the way that we put videos together here so that maybe we can just kind of make this a larger, more collaborative thing. Um, I would love Musicians Notepad to be a bigger community, that it's not just, you know, things that I'm coming up with. Because honestly, like, I think I'm already trying to play bigger than I can really handle. You know, there are times, again, the beginning of the year, I was doing a long-term sub. I did not have the time to put out more than one video a month and one publication a month. I've got all these ideas that need to get done, though. I would love to be able to farm those out to people if you're interested. Or if you have your own ideas, I'd love for you to bring them in because we want to put out content. We want to have this be a huge thing. Um, so if you're interested at all in being part of what we do here, send me an email, auto at musiciansnotepad.com, and we'll start working towards that. Other than that, you know, it's been a year of unparalleled growth for us. Um, you know, we started the year with just over 100 subscribers, and we're uh, 350 or more now. I didn't even check the number this morning. It's big. It's way bigger. So we've more than doubled this year, and we just, we appreciate it so much. Um, we really think we're going places, and we're glad you're part of that. Um, okay. Well, other than that, I'm going to go get back to work on that Soundbrenner Pulse body strap uh, video to get it out to you, and the next Groove of the Month, which needs to be out in, uh, you know, in a week here. And yeah, um, hope you guys had a good holiday, and uh, just looking forward to great stuff in the new year. 
Thanks, everybody. We really appreciate it. All right. Oh, yeah. Make sure to, uh, you know, like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. Let's hit it.